Weapons are shotguns, pistols, rifles, AK-47, an elephant gun, a crossbow, and a flare gun. Elephant gun? Yep. They have a crosshair icon and a damage number at the top left, a range icon and a number at the top right, uh, and at least one number in the top center to indicate the shots the weapon starts with. To use range weapon, a player declares which weapon he is he or she is using and which zombie he or she is shooting. I wonder. <laughs> shots always... Hit the target immediately, causing one point of damage to one zombie within range. The player rotates the zombie token clockwise so that the active number of health points is pointed toward the cabin and rotates the weapon card so that the number of shots left in the weapon is on top. Okay, the ranges of basic guns shooting outside the cabin. Um, it says... So basically, can we kill them, or do, or do we just, can we empty says, our card, I it guess? It says nothing about how many shots you can fire. But his, his card... My ability is once per turn, you may spend two bullets with one action. Okay, my special ability is oh, once oh. per turn, you may repair one crack in the arc. player performs two actions. Two actions, so you can fire up to two shots. Yes. Okay. Or okay. you she doesn't have two shots because she used an action. Right. She has. You have one action, and that. Well, this is this is because I, I draw another one. Remember, I brought out a zombie. Yeah, which means you still have another. You still have another action, so right. you can fire once. Once. Okay, so I fire once. So that brings me down to two. No, that, that should have been enough. That he's. I already moved him out of two. Okay. Well, yeah. Okay. okay. So there should be one point left on that. No, the, he, I already moved him to two previously. He had three. You shot him once. Can I shoot him three? No. 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 You only had one action. Ah, I'm going to <laughs> Okay, draw one event card. I still draw an event card, too? No, no. Your turn's done. Okay. So, well, now, when you finish, because you're the last person, the event card is drawn, but since Which that card is... already this, and all the zombies move one more space. So, we're going to get wrecked. <laughs> okay, so all the zombies move... All, in. hang on, all yeah, zombies... All zombies in the woods move one additional space during the move zombies phase. So, they're now all at the yard. So... What clearing. what do we regulate the zombies' movement as first off? Because it says move them again. So is it the? So it, it, I think they move one space. Wait, wait. Hold, on, have... hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see. On the lucky thing, they're only. Do they oh, they have, have different. Po they have different points. Yeah, so they have. Different... This one is a one. This one's a two. Two. This one's well, a two. The, the so silver that, that's is how, their HP. That's how many times okay. you have to. Yeah, how many Moving points? zombies. Yeah. During this phase, any survivor on the board game on the board move one space toward the cabin first. If the survivor makes it on into the cabin without dying, the survivor drops a radio piece in the first room he or she enters. Survivor remains in that room. Then the zombies move. Sprinters always move two spaces okay. during their. Oh my movement. gosh! So they're at the yard. They're at the yard. The sprinters are at the yard. Okay. Okay. Is that the only sprinter? Wait, yeah. I thought if they move one more, does that That's mean they are already doing attack? That's a brawler. Okay, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Um, sprinters move two spaces. Creepers move one. Only on a die roll of four or more. Oh. Who, who rolls for the zombies? Whoever. So, I'll roll for okay. this creeper and you roll for... Those creepers? No, you, why did you move him? Move him forward because he's a sprinter. Yeah, okay. he automatically moves. So this creeper moves ahead. I got a six for wow, a Wow, you guys brawler. are really great. No, 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 the the brawler has. It looks like he has. To and have other it. zombies move one space. What about a brawler? They move one space. That's other. Okay. I wasn't so, sure. So and this is all other. All zombies have an additional move. <gasps> so what if they're at the at the? Okay. Oh my god. The direction. I'll move these guys up ahead then. Dave. Zombie movement at walls. So the zombie can hit and or destroy a wall on their movement phase or as part of an event card. Most zombies crack a wall with one hit. The exception are creepers who never hit walls. Bless Sorry. Me, who never hit walls but slip right through into the cabin. <gasps> <laughs> Just gonna get 
right? <laughs> well, this one, this one only barely got here. No, the, these guys, except for the sprinters, everyone else is just in the yard. So the sprinters have cracked their walls. Right? So does it have oh, wait, any? Wait, wait, wait. Um, hang on. We only have one spl splinter, right? No, hang on. Even, let's see, um, the exception are creepers who never hit walls with a slip through into the cabin. So if the creepers get an extra move, then move them they, into the cabin. They don't. I've just moved everyone ahead except for the sprinters. Okay. Do the sprinters... Sprinters are no exception. They crack a wall with one hit even if the wall prevents them from moving their second spade. Zombies do not take damage when they hit walls. When a wall is cracked, a crack token is placed on the wall. If the player does not repair the crack and the wall is hit by a zombie a second time, the wall is destroyed. The wall is also destroyed if two zombies hit the wall at the same time. After hitting or destroying wall, zombies remain in the yard. They don't advance into the cabin until the next movement portion. Uh, this is true for sprinters as well, even though they would otherwise move to second space. So this this one, this, splint, this uh, sprinter here, cracked the wall. Yes. This one did too, over here. I guess I know what my next action is. Yeah. I am so dead. Actually, it's going to take you... Three actions to get over there. Uh -huh. okay. I have scared of one over here next to me too. Oh my God, you got one right there. I got another. Breaks, breaks, breaks. I have one in here. Okay. Breaks. Breaks. I have one in here and then one on the outside. I am I'm right next to you, and I have a candy bar. Yay! Save the day. <laughs> <laughs> okay, move zombies. Everybody move zombie. Yep. Okay. Okay. When a character lose a fight. His or her character must take an injury or drop the weapon she fought with. But you've got a gun, so you automatically win. Yes. So you don't take any damage from the zombie. Right. You don't take an injury. Pow. To blam, and he's like flying back, right, and you're, right. you're blowing him back. Okay, so um, the fight is you take a shot, you can take another shot at him. Okay. And that takes him down to one. Okay. So rotate your card also. Okay. Okay. I and can't then, do it. Okay. 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 All right. All right. Now, space, unless you have a ranged weapon. I do not. This sucks. Unless you want to break through the door with your fire axe. Hello? That'd be hilarious to be the, as a straight up card okay. doing more damage so you to could us. you pass, really, if you wanted to. I'm going to be through. I don't, have I don't it. care if it's my turn. Right. I'm dying over here. Um, I'm dying over here. Do you your owl voice? It's my owl voice. Okay, so I passed the bait. Because oh, you're you have to talk. Uh, Sandra. You have to talk like Sandra. Does that look like she has a voice? Yeah, it does. It looks like she has a very nasally voice. And then the convict will knife you. Because <laughs> of the convict. She doesn't actually say anything. She just. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm going to draw the cabin card. And you <laughs> a shot. And it's a shot now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm sitting there like, oh god, candlestick. <laughs> when the zombie is killed, it is put into a pile that is added back into the zombie bag when the zombie bag is empty. Okay. Oh, that ain't fair. They just keep it coming. Regenerating zombies. So yep. you win when you leave. Make it to the van. Okay. Down by, by the, the river. river. <laughs> <laughs> so now it's my turn. Um, Ooh, This is my weapon of choice, personally, for because even when the machete is dull, it can still do some yeah, You can do a tyrant and a machete. I'm going to then use this cabin car, which is hammer and nails, rebuild what? the wall in the arc you are in. No, you can rebuild it. That's not repair. You can put the wall back up. But you can nails. repair one You can repair it just a regular action. action. Yeah, she repaired it. Hmm. With the hammer and nails. So you don't have to use... That's if the wall is destroyed. Oh, you can okay. put it back well, up. Then, then I'll just you use your use the card. Cool. Larry, did you read this? Cool. No. On a result of ten, the zombie is killed. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> just outright slay it. So I am going to move one space and repair one crack. Yay! 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 Thank you. <laughs> okay. We might um, just survive the night. Don't, don't say that! that. <laughs> <laughs> <Hunt>. <laughs> Throw you outside. <laughs> oh, that was great. That was a great moment in Dwarven Tavern history. Okay. <laughs>